Well, you know, I've been having a hard time comprehending what I'm reading. And I don't know if it's the frequencies or I'm just, my brain is, you know, more and more damaged because of everything. Or I have been reading so many incomprehensible articles, information, that I can't quite comprehend it. I have to really pay attention to what I'm reading now. I have to pay attention to what I'm reading and pay attention to trying to comprehend it. Okay, U.S. military uh, in Texas today, they dropped an ammunition can from their helicopter, their Black Hawk helicopter, and you know where it landed? It went through the roof of an elementary school uh, classroom in Texas. So we had the Texas shooting today. Our military drops an ammo can onto an elementary school in Texas. And you know what the name of that elementary school was? Parkland. Florida, Parkland, shooting, Texas, shooting. Uh, uh, I guess it's a coincidence that it just fell on Parkland Elementary School. Yeah, the uh, can, it caused slight damage to the school roof and a classroom, as well as causing a power outage affecting a portion of the building. For some reason, our military has difficulty. Hell, it dropped ammunition right into the hands of ISIS. Uh, this isn't the first time the uh, military, they just can't keep objects in their helicopters. It happened in Oka um, Okinawa, Okinawa in Japan several times several times they dropped objects including a metal framed window it fell on Japanese schools on three occasions triggering massive protests and the incidents placed schools on high alert students at the Okinawa school close to a U.S. Marine Corps air station uh, were advised to take shelter more than 300 times since February as the military helicopters approached. <laughs> oh, I don't know what, I just, I, I don't know what. What do you say? What do you say? Huh? You want to listen to just a little bit? Let's listen to the news reporting on a Black Hawk helicopter. Oh, their ammo can fell out of the helicopter, hit Parkland Elementary School as a school shooting in Texas is ongoing. Fort Bliss officials releasing new information tonight. Not the shooting. That's not ongoing. But the event is ongoing. Night after an ammo can fell off a Black Hawk helicopter slamming through the roof of the Northeast El Paso school and into a classroom. The story we brought to you as breaking news at 5. Take a look at this. The incident happened at wow. 345 at Parkland Elementary School. According to Fort Bliss officials, the aircraft accidentally dropped the can while flying over the school. Isled ISD says the incident happened after school and no one was inside the class at the time. All right, look, um, in order for a can of ammunition to have dropped out of that helicopter, wouldn't you think that we had our soldiers in the Marine Corps up there very close to the opening of the helicopter. Perhaps, I don't know, were they putting that ammunition into a um, 
whatever you call them, those, you know, things that they sit behind and shoot off, you know, I look, all right, I, clearly I'm not a gun person and I don't know these things, but something's very wrong here, okay? Or guys, were you just playing with that can, tossing it around and oops, out of the helicopter it came and Americans actually think guns need to be taken out of the hands of Americans. Seems that Americans are a little bit more responsible than our military with their guns. I don't know. This country is really gone.